Hello fellow travellers, we are really excited to show you our second hotel in Bali. We moved from the luxurious Nusa Dua area to the busier and more hip Kuta Beach. Tribe Bali Kuta Beach is a brand new hotel that just opened in November this year. Tribe is also a very new brand in Asia, having originated in Perth, Australia and has only 7 properties in 5 countries so far. It is also part of the Echo Hotel Group. Tribe markets itself as a design-driven hotel that responds to the demand and desires of the modern traveller. According to Tribe, that means having plenty of social and co-working spaces, designs that are driven by guests' needs, immediate connection to the Wi-Fi devoid of unnecessary passwords, and artfully created spaces leaving guests stimulated and inspired. And for all you Instagram whores out there, this is a perfect hotel for you to take your IG-worthy photos to make your friends jelly. So here's our 54 square meter Tribe Comfort Extra Large Suite with Ocean View, the highest room category in the hotel. We were upgraded to this suite thanks to our Echo Platinum Elite tier and the room was simply amazing. It has a king size bed and all luxury amenities and facilities for our comfort and nothing we don't need. The room's clean modern design accentuated with art deco pieces and Balinese influenced furniture sourced from local artists to support the creative industry in Bali. And yep, that beautiful standalone bathtub was one of the main reasons why we chose this hotel. Strategically placed in the centre of the room between the open concept bathroom and the bedroom, it's a wet dream for all Instagrammers out there. At the lounge area, we were provided with a plate of sweet pastries for our welcome amenity and a handwritten note from the hotel. Next to the sofa is the door leading to the balcony that looks out to Kuta Beach. The view would have been a lot better if we had been given a room on a high floor, but I guess free upgraders can't be choosers, so we didn't ask for a change of room. The open concept bathroom has white marble tile walls at the basin area with a designer black sink and vanity top to contrast the look. The bathroom amenities were wrapped in simple tribe branded packaging, while the toiletries were from a local brand Aromel with pleasant lemongrass ginger scent. The separate shower cubicle is large enough for two persons and looks out to the balcony. while the hanging toilet further accentuates the design-driven element of the room. Here's Adil having some me time in the beautiful bathtub, sipping on some dubious looking drink. While unsuccessfully replicating a shower for advertisement. The bedside panels come with USB charging points and universal power sockets the rigor of modern hotels. The 49-inch smart TV can be swiveled to face the bed and easily screen mirrors from your own phone or laptop. However, as with most modern technology, it is not fail-proof, so we had to call for help. So that was a really fast and efficient service by the engineering team. To them about only five minutes uh, before, from the time I called, to them coming up with a brand new remote that works. The open concept wardrobe features plenty of space and hangers to hang your clothes, place your luggage, and a safe to store important documents and extra cash. The angled storage area below is well thought out to neatly store our shoes with an area to sit down while comfortably wearing them. The bar area is furnished with an espresso machine and coffee pots, tea sachets, and refillable glass water bottles. A wonderful green initiative we wish all hotels adhere to, plus an empty bar fridge. The hotel is located along the busy Kuta Beach and is within walking distance to other Echo properties such as the Mercure Hotel Kuta Beach, the Kuta Beach Heritage Hotel, and Pullman Bali Lagan Beach. Also nearby is the Beachwalk shopping mall for some shopping therapy of well-known international brands. With some local food and dessert options. 
So back at the hotel, the rooftop is where the beautiful infinity pool is located. Facing Kuta Beach, it truly is an amazing place to spend the entire afternoon at. While the pool is not large like those at Sofitel Nusa Dua, it was still adequate for a one night stay and the beautiful view made up for the lack in size. For those who don't want to miss their fitness routine, the tiny gym on the ground floor is equipped with the latest fitness machines to get your heart pumping and some free weights. Across the gym is a self-service laundry room for those who stay longer and not wanting to smell like you live out of a suitcase. Our evening was marred by the torrential rain which meant our plans to visit the night market were abruptly cancelled. But thank God for grab food, which delivered our favourite martabak right to the hotel doorstep, which made Ikram super satisfied. <laughs> Breakfast is served at the rooftop of the Glow Bar and Kitchen and offers a modest selection of buffet breakfast dishes. Serving both Western and Indonesian selection, the spread gives you the flexibility to stick to an eco-friendly healthy diet or immerse yourself in the pleasures of travelling. We opted to take our breakfast next to the pool and the sea as our view and continued to stay in the pool area to absorb more vitamin D. So this is the end of our 4 day 3 night adventure in Bali and we are lounging right here in the infinity pool of Tribe Bali Kuta Beach. And this is the real true infinity pool as it just stretches all the way to the ocean if you are seated at the edge of the pool and you know a lot of hotels claim that's to be infinity but this is really true infinity here. Yeah. And of course you can enjoy your lunch, your dinner or your breakfast like what we did are uh, facing the pool if you don't want to sit in the restaurant of the view of the infinity pool and the ocean just makes up for it. So true to the Kuta Vibe beach around here it's really uh, bustling with tourists and, and surfers. Yeah and surfers and they are they are right here in the morning uh, early morning surfing away. Yep. And the whole stretch where Tribe is located, you, there are a few other several echo hotels. We have Mercure, uh, there was Pullman. also Pullman, and the Heritage Hotel uh, that's managed by Echo as well. So if you want to try out Echo Plus uh, dining offers. And not forgetting that we are uh, right close to the Beach Walk Mall. Yeah, so you know, all your necessary needs, your shopping needs your dining and your grocery shopping, everything can be done there. It's really just a quick five minute walk away. So it's really convenient uh, where Tribe is located. So let's go to the things that we really enjoyed in this hotel. The pool for one, for sure. Uh, we spend most of our time here. And of course, the other thing is them recognizing all the benefits of uh, the Aircore Platinum Elite tier. So first of all, we got our welcome drink. That was really nice where we spent it. Uh, here of course at the pool and then we got upgraded to the extra large comfort room facing the ocean although they provided us uh, the room which was on the second floor which we couldn't really see the ocean much but still we got an upgrade to the highest uh, room tier here the first thing that I love about the room is actually the smell that hit me <laughs> and it was uh, it felt like a new car actually and I love the new car smell. So. It is a brand new hotel, so well, you know, we'll see whether they're able to keep it to that <laughs> standard in the next few months. Um, but the other highlight about the room is, of course, that standalone bathtub, which is like right smack in the middle of the room. Also helps that the bathroom is an open concept, so there is no door. You can immediately see the bathtub when you wake up. 
and of course the bathtub when you're in it it overlooks into the balcony and into the ocean if you do get a higher uh, room floor it's fitted with total brand faucets faucets and, and toilet. shower heads yeah. and i must say that the shower pressure is really awesome yeah and also i love the indonesian uh, brand toiletry the whole range smell of lemongrass and ginger which is really really nice unfortunately it rained like cats and dogs throughout half the day we decided to just rest in our room and we also ordered in grab delivery and our favorite matabak because we were trying to find a stall nearby uh, in the rain but there were none yeah because we were really looking forward to go to the night market here uh, we checked with the hotel and the hotel staff said that it might not be open because of the rain so in the end we decided to go for grab food delivery for the mataba so we ordered the savory and the sweet types so those two types and they were really yummy and one more thing the service here is really quite awesome uh, and they are quick when the remote control was down they came up uh, within five minutes to replace a remote control and also we didn't know how to use the door we didn't know how to close balcony the balcony door and yeah so you have got to lift up the balcony door before you actually or the handle before yeah. you actually close it i mean it's not the most intuitive <laughs> but more importantly how the staff uh, responded to us they're yeah. always full of smiles i mean that's generally the feel that we get throughout the two hotel stays here in, in bali Everyone's just so smiley and friendly um, and I think that's just natural in them as well. The Aww. food is okay. I mean, it's not the best tasting. Uh, some of the food, especially for the Indonesian dishes, uh, they were very tasty because they were either super salty or super sweet. <laughs> they could, you know, notch down a little bit on the salt and the, and the uh, sugar. Yeah, but I must say it's not too bad. And of course, uh, they don't have executive lounge. There's something that we knew from the start, so it's not something we would fault the hotel for. Some hotels just don't have that, and Tribe does not have that. Well, of course, with our Platinum Elite status, uh, we managed to get a free breakfast. <laughs> yep, free breakfast, free welcome drink, so all that was definitely provided to us. Uh, we would have asked for a late checkout, which I'm sure they would also provide, but our flight unfortunately was brought Reskin. forward and rescheduled to an earlier time at 1.55 so we'll probably have to leave here by 11. Okay, so I think we've pretty much rounded up our stay here at the Tribe Bali Kuta Beach. Um, how many meows are you going to give? I'm going to give four meows. Okay. Four yep, and I'm going to give similar four meows as well simply because of the brand new hotel, the rooms, the facilities here. It is definitely not a luxury tier like Sofitel but for these for that for this particular tier that they're in I think they did a very well then good job about it okay so we'll see you back in Singapore I think the next and our next trip. vacation we uh, are going on a cruise yes we will <laughs> not be in Singapore we'll be on the waters so look out for that and we'll see you again next time Tineng and Phuket woohoo bye bye